guys, what's up and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So you may be wondering why is she looking a little crusty and busty, but this is a get unready with me routine using all these viral Korean skincare products for the first time ever. I'm gonna be doing this routine for seven days straight to see if there's any change to my skin. of the products that I've got. I've gotten the full skincare routine. So the very first thing I'm gonna use is this Manyo cleansing oil. And it says on the directions, get the box, I keep the packaging because it's so pretty. Okay, so how to use this is you take a small amount and gently massage onto dry face. And then you add a small amount of water and massage again for about 30 seconds until the oil turns milky. Then you rinse it thoroughly with lukewarm water. And also, I've been seeing this thing on TikTok where they double cleanse their face, so they go in with this, and then just a gentle skin cleanser. So after this, I'm gonna be using Cetaphil Gentle Skin Cleanser just to like remove everything. Anyway, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna be opening it, taking the cap off, which is brand spanking new. Ooh, it's gotten that much in my hand. Oh, it smells really nice. most effective cleanser I've ever used and I don't f wow my skin doesn't feel dry at all you know how after you cleanse you kind of feel like you get really tight skin this one doesn't make me have tight it makes me feel really fresh and alive <laughs> It feels good. Okay, I love that cleanser. And it took off all my makeup in one go. Like usually some remnants of the eyeliner get left on my eyes. But you can see there's like nothing left. Anyway, I'm gonna go do my second cleanser in the shower. And then I'll come out and I'll speak to you guys and do the rest of my skincare. Hello. So I'm fresh out of the shower. I even washed my hair. I just did some rice water as my toner on my face. So as I was waiting for the skincare to arrive, I've been doing this DIY rice toner thing where it's literally just the water you use to wash your rice like that's the rice water and then i just dab it on my face i've got all my skincare sitting on the table here so let's dive right into it i have some acne marks and then some little pimples down on my chin that's because i've been a little bit naughty and i've been eating some like cake and stuff and i'm fructose intolerant so i always like break out which doesn't help the skin but hopefully some of the skincare helps remove that i think i'm gonna go in with this snail mousse in. I'm also reading all the instructions so I don't get anything wrong. Gently pat using fingertips to aid absorption. Okie dokie. This thing has a nice smell. Okay, I don't feel anything. It just feels like nice serum. Then I'm gonna go in with this glow serum from Beauty of Josin. Oof, I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm so sorry. Apply two to three drops of serum onto the face. I'm using three drops. This also doesn't have any scent, which is amazing. I'm a big fan of that because sometimes the scent gets too powerful for me and then it's all I can smell. The next thing I'm gonna do is go in with the Centella Blemish Cream. Apparently this one helps remove like your acne marks and pimples, which I, I just spoke about. So I have pimples down here and I'm so excited to try this. I hope it works like magic. Wow, so thick. It smells like tea tree. I'm gonna apply it on my spot. That one just said to apply evenly on the affected areas. So like, do I rub it in? Probably, right? You know what I probably should have researched is whether you rub that cream in or you're just meant to like leave it and if it's meant to be like your last step or whatever. Anyway, my very final skincare step is using this barrier cream by Soon Jung. It's a two times barrier intensive cream. I'm really confused how this works. Oh, wow. See, it comes out of the tops. Everywhere on my face, thank you very much. Oh, this is thick. Maybe I didn't need that much. Feels really nice on. I'm gonna put it on my neck. Okay. 
Okay, for this cream, it's said to use a pearl size amount. I obviously forgot to read the instructions before putting up my face and I used too much, but that's okay. It feels really nice and it doesn't feel like heavy. So I'm a big fan of all this skincare and it actually didn't even take me that long to put on my face, which I'm really happy about. So this is my skin on day one of trying out this Korean skincare. I will see you guys next week or day seven to hopefully see some improvement. Catch it. Hey guys, so it is a whole week later of me using the viral Korean skincare products as my night routine. And oh my gosh, I don't know if you guys can tell, but my skin has never felt more healthier and plump and hydrated. I feel like a brand new person and I've never felt like more confident in my skin. Let me first start off with, I did gain a few new blemishes, but I think that's just because I've been eating a bit bad. I had no reaction to these products which I'm so grateful for because that would have been like an absolute nightmare. I feel like all of these products have really helped fade my acne scars which is so great like way faster than Effica Duo. <laughs> Lol, well, I just thought I saw a spider and I got like real freaked out. It was just limp. Anyway, before I started using all these Korean skincare products, I used the La Roche-Posay range and I, there's nothing wrong with that range at all. But these Korean skincare products have faded my acne scars way quicker than Effaclair Duo from La Roche-Posay. So that's one thing I've noticed. The other thing I've noticed is when I get pimples, I use that Cosrx blemish cream and that helps the pimple go away so quick it's it's actually like magic definitely a staple if you have pimples none of these products dry out my face it in fact just makes me feel like my skin feels so nourished especially the cleanser it feels like I moisturized my face instead of like stripped it I'm really really happy with it let's do a close-up and this is only within seven days of using the skincare like Imagine if I stayed consistent with this routine for a whole month. I can't wait. I'm telling you, glass skin for me is gonna happen this year. There's like one spot of my face that I'm so proud of. It sounds so weird, but there's this area here and it's gotten so nice and like shiny and plump. Ah! It's so nice. So I would highly recommend all these products. If you'd like an updated skincare routine for the AM or for the PM, do let me know down in the comments below. Let me know what other Korean skincare products I should try. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.